Roblox Red was YouTuber and some of the top players use many different PvP techniques. So today I'm gonna show you some of the best techniques from which you can win many of your matches and stay till the end to watch out some clips by me outplaying the enemy. Now take a look at this clip by Tanker where his enemy got a stone sword but using this PvP technique he was able to win the sword fight. As you can see while spamming his sword he was aiming the crosser on his enemy while jumping. Now if you are aiming the crosser on the enemy it will help you hit a really great combo and if you are jumping at the same time you will dodge the enemy shot which will make you take less damage and by combining jumping, aiming and spamming the sword he was able to hit a really great combo. Now I decided to try this technique where I was going against two enemy and look what happened. Now take a look at the next clip again by Tanker where he was able to destroy a real hacker using shift lock combo method. As he was going near the hacker he quickly goes into shift lock and starts spamming his sword while aiming his crosser on the hacker. Now hacker was using kill aura so if he would have jumped to dodge the shot he would have failed because hacker can hit you from anywhere. So instead of jumping he tried to keep his shot accurate and hit more shots on the enemy. So in the next clip I was going against 3 enemies and using the same pvp method as tanker showed in previous clip look what happened. I got apples man, I got apples man, I got apples man. Uh, we lost not yet. No worries, no worries, no worries. I can still win this. But one, but two. Yeah, yeah, nice. I'm, I'm 4 HP. That's, that's why I was the UBJ behind you. GG's uh, bro. Well moving on to the next PvP method you need to use blocks to your advantage to win a sword fight. Now many people don't know but using blocks to build up quickly and getting high ground can help you hit really great combo on your enemy. Take a look at the next clip by many blocks here where he uses blocks to build up and to get the high ground to juke his enemy and wins the sword battle. So in this clip, I use similar method as mini blocks here and look what happened. Now take a look at this clip again by me, where I was going against 3 enemy and 2 of them were using auto clicker and look what happened. Where did he go? He's up there with you. He jumped down. Got him! Nice. Got him! The, the, the builder is using auto fucker. Nice pan, man! Got him! Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. I'll get him down. I'll get him down. I know, I know how. Nice! Got him, uh, Nice. Now moving on to the next and one of the most efficient way to combo someone is by getting an extra hit on them by a bow or a crossbow. Now using a bow or a crossbow in middle of sword fight can be really useful because you can drain enemies health by getting some extra shots on them. And this method can make you win many of the sword battles. If you are a Skywars player you might be familiar with this method of PvP or if you are trying to get some wins in Skywars this method will help you to win most of your matches in Skywars. As Skywars is pretty chaotic game mode to play I luckily got a crossbow at the start of the game and look what happened yeah, she's dead. Nice. oh Did you die? wait what I died and airy works um, what airy works cuz uh, I, I literally killed one of them and it just uh, give me the airy Moving on to the next PvP method where you have to use snowball in the middle of the fight. Now this PvP method is really overpowered which doesn't let your enemy to heal and it's 10 times more dangerous when you are using snowballs with the enchantment. Now take a look at some of the clips by me using this combo method. Yeah, he's in middle. My guess is probably he have a spiral static. None. 
Now in the previous clip, I basically tried to get first hit on my enemy with the snowballs and I knew before engaging in any sword fight, I can get my enemy few shots away. I basically got a slight advantage before going in the sword battle and if I had fire or static enchant, it would have been more better. In the next clip, I 1v2'd my friend in custom with snowball fire enchant 3 and look what happened. Bonus tip, if you see any hacker in your server, just spam snowball with fire enchant. Whenever you are chased by your enemy and you are crossing the bridge, I'll teach you a method from which you can outplay him. Now as you can see in this clip, I was being chased by my enemy and I outplayed them by jitter bridging behind the bridge. Now you don't have to use auto clicker for this, you just have to use jitter or butterfly clicking and you will be all set. If you don't know what jitter and butterfly clicking are, well those are the type of clicking method to get high click per second. Now if you are a minecraft player, you already know what those are, but take a look at the next clip where I use this method to outplay my opponent. Oh diamond diamond armor person dude, how amazing, diamond armor green reaper. Are they still behind me? Yes, he is behind you. Tell me if he's crossing the bridge with me. Is he? Yeah, he is behind you. Oh, he stopped. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, got him. Now take a look at some of the clips by me outplaying my enemy and enjoy. Two, one, go. <laughs> Did you expect that? No, I didn't expect that. <laughs> Green is kinda looking dummy. Green is looking dummy. Yeah. Dummy. The yeah, green is actually looking dummy. Come towards me, bro. Come towards me. Near me? Come near me? Hello? <laughs> I can hit you from here, dude. Hope you know it. Just target it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go up on me. Uh, one of them fell. Two of them fell. Yes. I can take. It. I can take it. This guy now. There's a lot of. Oh, you got a banana peel, dude. What are you gonna do with that, huh? Oh what? Oh what? Man outplayed himself. Yes, he is fine. Tell me if he's crossing the bridge with me. Is he? Yeah, he is fine. Oh, he stopped. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, got him. P50 likes on this video, I'll make a part 2 of it. Also, make sure you buy my merch. Link will be in the description below. It's only 10 Robux and it's the most quality merch you have ever seen. Credit to all of the people on the screen right now. This video was only possible because of them. Also, we are close to 11,000 subscribers, so subscribe. Yo, Ice Net, do you like cakes? Yes, I like cake. Subscribe for cake.